What is up, guys? Hey, Chris, I don't know if you remember. That's crazy. crazy. (laughs) You know, Jack said the same thing. So that just lets me know y'all are all in the same mind space, in the same head space. So Langston, Jack, Sam, and I'm missing one. Chris, no, I'm kidding. But (laughs) you guys, do you guys, did you guys before this, the bus down, bus down, did you guys know each other? Yeah, uh, we've known each other. I've known Sam, I think, the longest to okay. her for over a decade because uh, we started in comedy in Boston uh, around the same time. And then Chris, Jack and I have known each other since like 2015, 2014, 2015, because we all did uh, JFL New Faces together. So we, we've known each other a long time. And this show has been in the works uh, for five plus years. So wow. It's a journey. Right. I can tell that um, you guys have a very close and personal relationship just because I was talking to, you know, Sam and Jack and we talked about who's who writes and you you all write for this show. So and it, I mean, it wasn't a hard transition because you all have a background in comedy. Right. So that wasn't hard. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it was. I mean, it was. It, it was challenging as far as like trying to beat the 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 last funny thing that we we, we were writing. And we're all perfectionists in that in that regard. But um, it was the most fun I've had in a writer's room on set. Um, even doing uh, marketing stuff, all all the little logistical stuff that shouldn't be fun. It, I you know I even. I enjoy it because because of the fact it's 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 these four or these three. I can't pick right. That's four. That's really <laughs> <laughs> I noticed that you guys are all executive producers. Kudos to you. All black cast, loving it. And then um, Chris, you have worked with Lauren Michaels, who is also an executive producer on the show. Did he help kind of push the show, or was this something that? you know, people have been spotting and seeing and knew that they wanted to pick it up. Lauren pushed contracts towards us, pushed money in our accounts and <laughs> make some great and don't embarrass me. <laughs> we did that shit. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, he's a champion for the show, man. He's, uh, you know, he called me up and uh, to, to, to show me love for it. 10 minutes before uh, I had to be out uh, on live TV on, on a Saturday. So I, I was like, oh, I was very honored and also very nervous because I had a lot of lines to learn. Uh, <laughs> yeah, but he's always been supportive, man. Yeah. So Langston, um, one of the episodes that I really love, um, you guys, first of all, let's talk about all the social issues that you tackle on this show. But very funny. It's not like, OK, I feel like I'm being preached to. But I always worry. I'm like, is this going to like you're toting the line, but the episode that I found funny with you, there was several Langston, but the one when you've gotten in a fight with Friday and his yeah. poo-poo bag, yeah. like, that was so <laughs> disgusting. I didn't, I was just like, where did they come up with this crazy shit? Like, where are they getting this from? So was who heavy wrote that? Was that you, Langston? Was there an experience that you had with someone? Like, I how did- I wish that I could take responsibility for that. That truly was Jack Knight's uh, brainchild. He, he, from the the moment he met me, uh, has been wanting to write a, a an episode where I go crazy because he genuinely believes that I am filled with a deep dark rage, and so uh, he he had the most fun I think out of everybody coming up with uh, my explosion and ultimate defeat in that episode. That was wild, but I really enjoyed watching this show and I cannot wait for season two. I wish we had a little bit more time. Um, I want to just thank you guys. Chris, I don't know if you remember when you were here in Chicago, I hung out with you a little bit. I do. I remember you, girl. (laughs) <laughs> so we gotta, we gotta like get a, a long interview like oprah style you know what i mean yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll, come right. the, I'll, I'll come sit by the fireplace we just talk about life books mm-hmm. hey fireside chat let's do it i'll tell you i'll tell you how the queen hurt me you know <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys, it was a pleasure talking to you. Thank you so much. And like I said, good luck with season two. I love it. I love it. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Bye.